Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. Before you replace the carburetor intake gasket in your snowblower, make sure the engine has cooled. You can use an 8mm socket to unthread five of the six bolts securing the muffler cover. You will need to use an 8mm wrench to unthread the 6 bolt. Use a 3 8 inch socket or nut driver to unthread the mounting bolt, securing the housing to the rear bracket. Next, unthread the screws to release the two retaining clamps, holding the housing to the handle. Now use a half inch socket to fully unthread the upper bolts securing the handle assembly. Lower the handle and you can fully remove the muffler cover. Detach the primer hose from the carburetor. Be prepared for some fuel to spill. Disconnect the wires from the key switch terminals. Use a 10 mm socket to unthread the nuts, securing the control housing. Pull the housing off of the mounting bolts. You can now slide off the old intake gasket, if still intact. Install the new carburetor intake gasket by sliding it onto the mounting bolts. Reposition the control housing, then thread and tighten the mounting nuts. Connect the wires to the key switch terminals. Attach the primer hose to the carburetor. Reposition the muffler cover and thread the six bolts to secure. Reposition the handle assembly and re-thread the upper bolts. Align the two retaining clamps and thread the screws to secure the housing to the handle. Re-thread the mounting bolt to secure the housing to the rear bracket. Your snowblower should now be ready for use.